are you feeling, Mark, ahead of tomorrow's game? No, we're pretty confident. Obviously, um, we've had a bit of time off now. We've had a week and a half um, since our last game. So the boys are refreshed, ready to go. Um, you know, we're looking to, to continue this run. Um, you know, going to Tassie, it's not going to be, be easy. Um, it's going to be a tough game. Um, you know, Western United are, are, are a great side, you know, with a lot of quality. Um, so we have to, we're going to have to be on our, on our toes to, to make sure we come away with all three points. And how have you gone against Western yeah, we played them earlier on in the season. Um, we come back from 2-1 uh, down and we won 3-2. Alou came on, scored two goals and uh, you know, I thought we played well that game. Um, we were the better team um, and we're looking to, to do the same again tomorrow. What are you worried about that they might bring? Oh, look, they have a lot of quality all over the field. Obviously, um, Diamante's missed a couple of weeks due to injury, so I'm sure he'll, he'll come back into the team uh, tomorrow. Um, we know how how dangerous he is on set pieces, um, but not only him, they've got quality all over the field. Berisha is another one. Um, you know, his, uh, his re reputation speaks for itself. Um, you know, top goal scorer in the league. Um, you know, we're going to have to be on our guard to keep him out. So, so you guys are playing a great season, but how, how are you looking, um, like, how are you feeling, I guess, with training and everything? No, I'm feeling very good. Obviously, um, touch wood, there's not been any real injuries. The boys are fresh. Obviously, we've had a bit of time off since our last game, so all the boys are raring to go. Oh, look, obviously, um, you know, our last game, um, you know, was, uh, was a long time ago. Um, you know, it's nice to have a bit of a break, but in saying that, I'm one for, you know, playing games like straight after one another. Um, you know, I'm a big fan of short turnarounds. Um, but it's good, obviously, after the last game, you know, it, it took a toll on us. So it was good to have a bit of a break, refresh, um, recharge the batteries. And like I said, we'll be nice and fresh for tomorrow night. Yeah, massive. Um, from what I'm hearing, I'm hearing there's going to be a, a lot of supporters travelling to Tassie for the game, and you know that's great for us, great for the club. You know we love their support, um, and it's important for us now to go on a bit of a run. You know there's 11, 12 games left, um, you know of the season, so you know we want to go on a bit of a run, win four, five, six games, and really cement ourselves in that top two position and. Uh, you know, I strongly believe in this group that we can definitely go all the way this year. Just one more before you go. Um, conditions tomorrow night down in Tasmania. It's pretty uh, rare for a team to play down in Hobart. Have you had a look at what the temperature is going to be for a 5 past 5 game? Yeah. It's going to be cold, no? It's going to be freezing. It's going to be cold, so <laughs> that's good. I like playing in the cold weather. I've played in the cold weather before in Europe. Um, you know, hopefully... Uh, it's good for the boys, actually. You know, they can run a lot in the cold weather, so there'll be no excuses tomorrow night for for players not running. So, um, no, looking forward to it. Um, it'll be my first time to Tassie. Um, you know, I've heard a lot of good things about it, and uh, really looking forward to the trip.